Hello guys and welcome to another video. Today it's going to be a bonus video. Because we already uploaded today, uh, I clicked my magic button again, cool. Uh, no, uh, now we're going to do some guild war because I actually think these opponents are very worthy. Uh, I'm pretty sure they all have fully awakened units and I'm pretty sure our asses are getting a little bit kicked, you know what I mean? Club Anubis, never heard of these guys, but uh, when I checked they all looked like super awakened and they had like the season one border like this guy so i was like wait what uh, uh never mind that, that guy no no not that, not that guy okay but yeah but most of the people here are fully awakened not that guy. <laughs> all right never mind i will look for the fully awakened though i'm gonna look for the hardest fights i can get and uh, this time we're just gonna try hard because uh, the last two uh, guild wars we just kind of memed this time we're going to try hard a bit and uh, get our three victories in the back. All right, so uh, I'll find I'll find you when I get the the first opponent. Okay, this guy has decent amount of uh, shields. Aethron, uh I'm going to fight him. Uh, we're going to use uh, different comps, but we mostly want to win. So because we want to win, we will go for a very interesting Comparuno. For the first one, I think I could do with a cleaver. That is not very specific, but you'll see what I mean. For the first one, I need ML Basar. Let me just put Basar on the, on the, the bottom one. Actually, it's not a great team. It's not a great team to take Basar on the bottom, huh? Probably a Earth Bait would be okay. And then they have Krau. So having a fire unit to bait would be amazing as well. So yeah, that's what we'll do. We're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna mix things up a little bit. For the top team, uh, we could try to outspeed the Dizzy and kill them all, but then Charles can pop off. So we're gonna, we want to avo avoid that at all costs. So we're probably gonna take this and Blingo. I don't think we'll need a reviver here, uh, especially because of the um, the Charles. Because if he, if he strips, we're screwed anyway. So there's no point. Um, I could also take a defense breaker just to finish things just to finish things off faster. That could work, actually. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go balls deep Rooney on these peoples uh, because uh, there's not a, there's not a lot of speed threats here. So we're just gonna go for the cleave, uh, and that's what we'll do. Um, on the bottom team, I need a fire unit that can tank these people, and uh, Achilles is good because uh, Achilles can bait the crow. Because the crowd will always S3, uh, even if the fire unit has uh, invincibility on. So that's what we'll do. So we're going to take Achates, and then we're going to take something that gets to nuke things. The Basar, I'm not sure about the Basar pick. I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. Doesn't sound like the best pick for me. So we're probably not going to pick anything too risky. So we're probably going to go with the standard. We could use ML Surin. She would be okay here. Because even she, if she gets targeted for some reason, we should be okay. I think so. Alright, let's see. What? Who would I take with Surin? Because I don't have a defense breaker. Okay, I will take Surin though. Mm. I'll take Basar. Okay. I've decided, I think. This doesn't this doesn't look very good though. What do I normally use for turn turn two teams? Yeah, I normally use my Blingo versus these teams. Oh well, this is what we'll use. Uh a water DPS would be, would be nice here actually. Well, never mind guys. We're we're I guess we're not tryharding. <laughs> On that bottom team, I guess we're not tryharding, and and I guess we're connecting as well, so that's cool. Uh, all right, let's let's jump into it. For the first one, should be easy enough. Yeah, they they don't even outspeed us on the first one, so we're just gonna go with a good old boost, and then we're gonna defense break because none of them have uh, defense breaks, and then we're gonna burn with Blingo and hopefully dispatch of most of them. Ooh, we actually land the three defense breaks. All right, boys. You know what this means? No, you know what this means, don't you? It's time for a full cleave. We didn't crit. We didn't crit, but it was. It's not. It doesn't matter. Okay. <laughs> First team, pretty easy. 
done, one and done, easy peasy. All right, this team, not so easy. The reason I took Vassar uh, was because of the fact that uh, they get immunity. And I'll, I'll explain to you why I don't want them to get immunity in a second here. It missed on the Charon, but that was pretty much expected. The Charon should go for my Basar, which means that I should be able to protect Basar. I don't need this skill right now. Yeah, I'm just going to protect Basar. So he goes for someone else. Yeah, now he goes for ML Surin. Hopefully he doesn't uh, silence her. That would be big poop. Okay, it did not silence her. But we do get to burn this, and uh, we'll unbuffable the uh, the Charon. Then we get to kill him faster. Don't know how he didn't crit. She legit has 95%. Don't know how she didn't crit on two units. Uh, but this is okay. Now we'll just debuff them a lot. Uh, now I keep going on the Charon. How, how is she not critting? I'm actually very confused. I need to full heal here. Should I burn for this heal? I guess I should, just to top everyone off, just to guarantee everyone's healthy. I'm actually confused how she's not critting. She, del she legit has a lot of crit chance. I, I'm really confused. Okay, she, th she, this is not going to do much, only heals. And the crowd isn't going to do much either. I will further on push them back and uh, debuff them, because that's what we, we want. We want cycling here. Okay, can I, can I get a crit on this Charon? Please. Please, I legit have so much crit. Okay, there we go. That's what we wanted. Okay, there we go. She, he's dead. He's dead because of the unbuffable. Unbuffable is really strong, and because uh, uh, ML Surin is a neutral type, uh, it's actually pretty good. And, I'm so sorry, we don't have in-game sound, but now we do. Uh, should I do this on myself? There, there's no point on using it on anyone right now, so we're going to keep going. Uh, I'll actually take down the Angelica first. Whose turn is it today? Whose turn is it today? Okay, this may be a little bit too loud. Okay, uh, should I heal anyone? I don't think there's a point to heal yet. I'll put my invincibility on once, once it's time. I just want to kill this Angelica as fast as possible. But I'm actually just giving her uh, stacks for her thing. Ooh, it's Elbrus. Oh, how do you, how did we resist actually? That is amazing. <laughs> uh, legit, I, I think my uh, ML Surin has zero resist, like legit zero. So it's sort of amazing that it, she, she actually did that. Um, I'm gonna push him back and debuff him a lot, just to not lose any units. I wish I had some slow in this team. Would be nice. Okay, we're we're just gonna full heal here. Round and round. I guess this team kind of worked out pretty well. Uh, I do not want to trigger him, but I think I'll trigger him. So, okay, I did not trigger him. Okay, I did. <laughs> Hopefully, it's not enough damage. I don't think so. She's full HP, right? Yeah, she'll survive. She'll take damage, but she'll survive. It's okay. And this is good, because now we don't have to beat around the bush. We just uh, we just heal, and uh, yeah. We just burn here for a little bit of that damage. The bleeds, not gonna lie, are pretty good. Not gonna lie. The bleeds on the um, ML Surin are pretty nice. They, they chunk a bit more than you expect, actually. And because she's on lifestyle and she has a decent amount of attack, it actually deals a good amount of damage. So that's our first victory. Uh, let me find another opponent, and I'll find you then. Okay, this is definitely a team I want to take on. I want to take, the, I want to take this team on really bad. Because, as you can see, um, they have, uh, they've, they've been winning a lot. Two of my units, and the Desolator is a pretty good unit. Uh, is a pretty, bit, pretty good uh, guilty. He's, uh, he's in high challenger. He's one of the strongest ones in my guild. So uh, that's that. That in, in the bottom, I believe that should be a fast Charon. So we're gonna we're gonna draft here. Uh, for this team, 
I want to take a light bait for that uh, assassin Kali. And uh, nothing better than... Uh, whew, I actually have a bit of a fear here. Because I want to take this guy, Pavel, and the Luluka and the Eaton. This is my normal cleave. But the problem is, I am not sure if they have immunity. I'm, I'm sure my, uh, my, my guildies got the info for that, but I'm, I haven't checked it <laughs> as the good guildie that I am. Um, therefore, I do not know. But nonetheless, for the bottom team, I will change things up. Because there's an RB in there and I have my slots free, I'm just going to go for this. I'm going to go for the boys and the boys. It's a pretty good team for this. Uh, the RB dies pretty fast, there's no damage mitigation, and uh, the Charles gets to do a lot of things, but the, with the Reviver we should be okay. Um, and that's that. There, I don't think there's much of a need for G Pergus in this one, because there's not, there's not a lot of the AoE that I actually need to get, to get triggered here. Um, for the first team, uh, it's a matter of immunity sets. If they have a lot of immunity sets, it is, it is kind of risky, not going to lie. Um, but we'll see how it goes, because they have squishy units. Uh, at least the A-Kali should be pretty squishy. And uh, yeah, at least that. But we'll see how it goes. All right. Uh, it, it is risky, but I'm going to try it. Because I like Pavel, and I like using this, so it's pretty nice. Okay, let's see how it goes. They do have immunity on the chem, which is not too bad. Because uh, as you can see, my my dude is on Perlucia. But let me tell you. She has a lot of damage. That Akali has a lot of damage. I wish I could kill them before they get the revive buff, but I guess I won't. Okay, the Akali's dead. No matter what. But I would like to kill the Ken. I think my uh, guy survives, because uh, even with the attack buff, uh, Perlucia should keep me alive. Barely. <laughs> Barely alive, though. Barely. I, can, I cannot one-shot this guy, can I? He deals a lot of damage, so I will risk it. I will risk it for the Biscuit. But he's gonna AoE, and then my Pavel's gonna die. Yeah, this wasn't very well drafted, because uh, it, it was... If I if I had that uh, defense breakdown, this guy should die, though. Okay, he didn't die, so I'm, I'm legit just dead. Uh, playing this one out. Oh, never mind, I couldn't save him. Uh, there was there's not much of a, a plan here. Um, yeah, I'm not even. Gonna, there's no point. Oh, oh yeah, I remember. I can't quit uh, because of the uh, magic button. <laughs> so there's that. I cannot quit this one. So we're just gonna lose here, and uh, that's that. Yeah, we we could have we could have picked definitely something better there, but yeah, it was it was pretty pretty obvious that they would have uh, immunity sets. So. That was, that was kind of dumb. Could have played with someone else. Could have done light bait basar cleave or something. But whatever. Um, or spez. Actually, that was a perfectly spezable team. But oh well. Let's move on. Uh, with this, guys, we're just going to go normal cleave. We're going to protect first turn, let them do their things, and then we go. Alright, so this, this one should be a clear win. But we kind of entered on the first one unnecessarily, because we could we could we could have checked the info that our guild has got. Uh, but whatever. Ooh, greater attack buff, nice one. Not lucky at all. So this guy is not on uh, Dreamblade, which means that we should be able to get a good clean kill. We need to stun this guy though. Come on, stun. Oh no no no! The maid Chloe might die. Not just the Maid Chloe, actually. Okay. Okay, it's time to cleave and heal, so let's do that. Okay, Charles, that too? So, we, we didn't miss. How did we miss uh, on that guy? We fully healed, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Okay. Now Basar is in a big, big Turaburu. Hmm. Should I proc the dude? Because he's going to keep a wing until I proc him, so I believe my uh, Blingo gets to one-shot the the RB, 
So I'm going to try to trigger this guy. Yeah, he's on Moonlight Dreamblade. I missed. I did, I did. Oh no, that was not well thought up. That was not well thought of. I don't think I can steal one shot without attack buff. Hmm. Okay, I guess I can. But that is dangerous. Okay. Are we going to get soloed here by a Kiran? Because this would be a shameful thing to happen. I don't think she'll, he'll one-shot me, though. I think he'll do this, die, and then we kill. Okay. We win, but... Uh, unfortunate. Unfortunate. <laughs> that draw was legit uh, an int. Uh, we could we could have dealt with that better. But whatever. We did it. Okay. Okay, on to the la the last match here because uh, I'm looking at some interesting things. Uh, on the top team, uh, on the top team, that should be a DPS uh, Bologna. It's kind of weird, not gonna lie, but uh, we'll we'll go versus that. It's fine. So uh, let's see. What do we pick here? Hmm. I'm actually curious. I'm probably just gonna go as meta as meta as you possibly can get <laughs> with this. Um. Let me see. A lot of fire units sounds good to me, actually. <laughs> sounds good, sounds good. Um, I could also use that, but no. Okay. Water unit here is not the best. I could outspeed his Basara just for flex points, right? I guess I can. I'm actually gonna. <laughs> just because. Just because. I want to I wanna have some flex points. Um... For the bottom team, it's just random RGB. It's kind of weird. Because they're being weird, I shall be weird too. I think I think that whole thought of uh, of actually tryharding went out the window very fast. Very, very fast. But we should be okay here. Eh, whatever. Whatever. We have OP, OP units. So we can just uh, smash them in the random team and it works. Ha! Actually, it's a pretty slow Basar. Should I burn this? Eh, I guess. I guess I won't. I guess I won't. I got I got them big balls, you know? The big corones. Right. Hopefully I can push them further. I will try you. But no further. Push them further. Come on, do it. Okay, I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. Don't hit the Karen. Okay, the Karen is safe. We just gotta do care on things now, and we should be okay. Ooh, Abyssal Crown, dude. Let me just kill this Tenebria, because she's the only one that could annoy me. So let me just kill her, get my attack buff on. No crit. Cool. Cool. <laughs> no idea how I, I get to not crit. I guess when you don't have 100. Yeah, th this was a DPS, uh, d DPS uh, Bologna, so... Will my Karen get to attack? I'll show you nope. I, okay, actually, yes. <laughs> I'll provoke just for my Karen to do some damage. Show it what. Show us what you got, Karen. Okay, that's okay. That's not amazing. It's just okay. All right, let's go to the sixth fi second fight. Um. Wait, <laughs> that was not meant to happen. Uh, I'm gonna S three here. S two here. Try to stun some peeps. We got one stun, not too bad. Now we're gonna get stripped. I wonder who's who's gonna get stripped with this team. Tire them out. That's right. uh, he goes for the Spezzo boy. That's not good. I, will fight them. I guess you will. will you fight until the end? This is not good though, because uh, we're gonna get dunked by the SSB uh, just because he got debuffed. Okay, so Spez is dead. So. That's not amazing. I need to kill things. Not gonna lie. <laughs> not gonna lie. I need to. Th I need to legit just kill things. Uh oh, Sermi's gonna tap me. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Who do I need to kill here? I have an healable on. Oh shit. Uh oh. Cleanse me, please. Cleanse me. Can I heal enough, though? Leave it to me. I need to kill the Sarmia, but can I heal enough? That's the question. She should be dead, right? Yeah, she's dead. 
Can I out sustain this? <laughs> That's the question. Uh oh, defense break. I don't think I can out sustain this. Uh oh. She's out speeding me. Heal up. Oh no, please. Oh no, that was close. We could have done that, but no attack buff, we're not missing, like, she's not missing with our thing. And that's another draw, so uh, this was a pretty inti Guild War instead. I, I legit said wanted to try hard and stuff, and then we just ended up inting. That's cool. Uh, well, that's the bonus video for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.